we are playing this Lorehold, uh, what's it called, v Velomachus Lorehold uh, deck with Dragon's Approach, and it's gonna be crazy. Um, yeah, essentially we're just trying to turbo out this card as soon as possible. It's also best of one. We don't even have a sideboard, I guess. Yeah, we don't even have a sideboard. We don't even need one. We're never going to play uh, anything besides best of one with this. Um, yeah. Um, sorry, making sure everything else is good. Yeah, it looks like we're all set. Um, I, I do have... Oh, I guess I didn't do it on... Let me see if I still have the... Extension for... I think I do. I still have the extension for... My extensions... There we go. The Stream Decker is the one that I have? Wait. Yeah. Uh, yeah, here we go. Stream Decker, and I believe I just have to set up my... Uh, active deck here. Okay, we have that. Just have to do decks. Upload new. Okay, so I'm just gonna take this guy and download... Export. There we go. Paste decklist, there we go. Submit. And we go set as current, right? I think there's everything, yeah. Perfect. I'm gonna go and check on that, make sure that that's up. Stream Decker active? I don't see it. Hmm. Let's do that. Have it as component one so that it will show up. I don't know. Otherwise, we're just going to get started with the games. All right. And we're going to do ranked. We're doing the ranked. We ain't no chicken. We ain't chickening here. Hopefully, Cardboard Life is, uh, is doing its thing. Hopefully, it is. Just gotta hope. It's kind of about all I can do. Alright, um, so we have no red mana, so we have to mulligan this, unfortunately. And I'm lagging super bad. For some reason. Maybe it's the graphics that need to go down. Quality level. Medium. Let's do that. All right. We're all right, gonna cathartic reunion away these dragons approaches, and we have uh, thrilling discovery here, which is really nice. Okay, they're playing a cultivate. All right, so we should have a turn four. So you can just play a Thrilling Discovery. Discard two of these. Might as well play a Plains. And next turn we can just cast Dragon's Approach and get ourselves a Lorehold 
on the battlefield. Oh god, not this. Yes, this. Hold on. I'm gonna close up some stuff, because... There we go. Oops. Hold on. I'm just gonna cast Dragon's Approach here. Take action. Hopefully they don't have removal. Do they have removal? Why is my uh, computer lagging so much? Um, let's just cast a Dragon's Approach. All right, that looked pretty good. Oh, I'm gonna close up some of these things. Okay. Are we good now? We're kind of good. Oh, look, they have ultimatum. We're dead. Uh, don't we just lose here? What did I get with this? We don't want them to get... This, right? Oh, no, then they just ult this. Um... So we probably take this. No, but then I cast Valky for free. I think we need to just take Valky here. If we draw a mountain, we can cast Storm's Wrath and then attack with Warholm. Yeah, I feel like Valky is the thing to take here. I don't know. I'm not really sure about that. Why is this going on? Looks like Discord is taking up a lot of space. Oh wait, no, I would not like to block. Just realized what was going on there. Looks like Aruna has kind of crashed. I'm going to restart Aruna after this. I think that's the problem. Uh, I should also probably just concede now. Because uh, they get Kiora vs. Sea God and whatever that, Valky. Yeah, I'm just going to concede. I don't feel like playing this game. I'm going to restart uh, Aruna and, and, and uh, hope that that fixes things. Why is Streamlabs? Hmm. Streamlabs seems to be good. Yeah, I think it's just Arena. Huh. <sighs> All right, there we go. Hopefully, we're not uh, lagging out here. Looks like, no, all right. Looks like we're good. All right, is there anything? No, I'm good. That looks like there was some. All right, we're good, all right, we're good now. All right. Hey, this looks pretty good. Mm -hmm. All 
All right, so we'll play Merchant of the Veil on turn one. We get this is an instant, so we can surprise our opponents. Oh no, not white aggro. Cathartic reunion. Uh. Um, well then, what are we doing with this? Probably just playing Merchant of the Veil. Vale? No, because I'm about to Wrath, so I guess I just Thrilling Discovery, discard this, and a land? No, I want the land, right? I'm going to discard, uh, I'm going to discard the land and be a little greedy here. I feel like I'm going to draw land. Okay, we drew land. So I can Storm his Wrath this next turn, and then start casting approaches again. It's fine. What is this? So we just Storm's Wrath here. Get rid of the board. Okay, it's fine. So we can... Ruling Discovery. Discard Approach. Plus Cathartic Reunion, probably? Now we can play this. And do we have how many approaches? Oh, we have enough approaches, so we can just cast Dragon's Approach here. Boom. 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 Um, we can cast another Dragon's Approach, or we can cast Storm's Wrath. Oops. Ah, oh, again, apologies for the lighting. I'll put like a warning or something. Um. There's no real way for me to fix that right now. Uh, I'll just catch Dragon's Brooch. Uh, yeah, unless they have lethal, right? Yeah, that's fine. Attack me for four. I'm not even gonna block. Wow. Wow! <laughs> Oh, we won a game. Honestly, that's a success. Winning a game is a success, in my view. Uh, won a game. Got there. Uh, can someone check if uh, Stream Decker is working? I don't know if Stream Decker is working. I don't know if I can check. Because I'm, I'm seeing it through, like... The streamer view. Uh, snap keep. I see cathartic reunion and dragon's approaches. Uh, I mean, the deck list is pretty simple, but uh, still. Alright, we'll. Thrilling discovery here. Alright, we're set up for a turn for. Uh, Oh, but it's rogues. Actually, wait, that's kind of good, because they're going to mill dragon's approaches. Hmm. <laughs> but it's like, what is this? What is their opponent doing? So they, they could leave up Counterspell. Uh, oh, but they're just going to do that. What is this? Oh, it's a rogue. I didn't even realize that was a rogue. Uh, I'm going to Thardic Reunion here. Discarding some approaches. Oh, I guess that was probably something I should consider, but that's fine. Do I? It's, I guess it depends on what they do this turn. 
I feel like I need to Storm's Wrath here. I'm expecting them to counter it though, and that's okay. Yeah. So that's fine, because because now I want to be able to cast Dragon's Approach. I need I want to resolve my Dragon's Approach uh, when that comes around. All right, here's a Dragon's Approach. Do you have a counter spell? Please don't have Test of Talents. Tests of whatever it's called, the uh, exile of the cards that have the same name. All right, that's fine. Uh, it's getting a little bit less fine because how many dragon spurs we got? We have a bunch, so we can actually double. Oh no, we can't double because uh, we only have Vorhold. Uh, low hold. Are we? We're not dead. Opponent putting more dragons approaches in our bin for us. Thank you, opponent. They're drawing an extra card. They probably do have a singular counter spell here. Ooh, they milled another lore hold. All right, here is a dragon's approach. We have a lot in our in our graveyard. All right, there's that. Let's go to combat. They have a removal spell. And we lose. <laughs> oh, this deck's so bad. Oh, this deck is so bad. Ay, ay, ay. We're gonna make it work. We're gonna make it work. We're gonna do it somehow. We'll do it. All right. I really like these new avatars. What do you guys think of the new like kind of avatars that they have? Can I keep this? I don't think I can. I mean, I could, but like it'd be risky. This is even worse. Wow. Wow. I didn't think it could get worse. It just got worse. <laughs> Everything's going wrong. Uh, all right, this is fine. Uh, what are we putting back? Put back this. I'll put back a dragon's approach. Let's put the dragon's approach on top. Uh, <laughs> this is, oh, I was about to be like, this better not be another rose. All right, here is Dragon's Approach. Two in the bin. I drew Cathartic Reunion, which is nice. All right. So I'm probably just casting Cathartic Reunion here, discarding the Merchant and the Dragon's Approach. Okay, you know what, now I wish I had kept the merchant. I was like thinking about what happens if I draw um, that, but it's all right. Um, we're not under any pressure, but our opponent probably has removal because they're playing black. All right, uh, that's pretty good. I think we're gonna play that and then thrilling discovery, discarding approach and thrilling discovery. Should do it again? No, right? I should probably just keep uh, Dragon's Brooch in my hand. All right, what's our opponent got? Nothing? All right, here's a Dragon's Brooch. Yes, I would like to take that action. I would like my opponent to use their mana and kill my Vorhold. Lorehold. I keep on saying Vorhold, not Lorehold. And here's the removal spell. <laughs> All right, murderous riders. They go to 15. Um, we have to play some more dragons approaches and stuff, but 
Uh, oh, so they're playing this in mono black? Interesting. Alright, so we're gonna Thrilling Discovery, discard two approaches. Maybe I just cast a Dragon's Approach here? Because I have to draw more anyways, and then next turn I can cast Storm's Wrath while I wait. Right? That seems like a fine play. If I top deck a, another Dragon's Approach, I can loot it away with Merchant. Yeah, there's a lot of things that you can draw here. It'll be uh, interesting. Alright, um, well that we can loot away. That I'm just gonna haggle. Haggle, haggle, haggle. Boop. Okay, we'll just play that. So I can top this planes to just play the lore hold, which I think I'm just gonna do. And I'll play a uh, merchant to bait out a removal spell. Whisper Squad, okay. Are they holding up another removal spell? I have two cards in hand, why? Alright, well, I'm gonna jam, because that's what this deck does. That is the only thing that this deck does. Yep, they have another removal spell. This could also just be Whisper Squad activation. What do they got? Yep. <laughs> Uh, okay. Uh, that's two of my lower holds down. There's one more in our deck somewhere. Okay. Alright, let's... Uh, do we have a dragon's... How many dragon's approaches have we got in our bin? So I can activate this, and if I top deck another dragon's approach, which is likely, then we can dragon's approach again. All right, well, <laughs> we got lucky in that regard, but I feel like our opponent is once again countering our deck by having removal. I mean, yeah, I guess we can Storm's Wrath next turn. Get rid of the Ayara, and then, um, I guess I should wait, should I wait for my opponent to, like, do stuff? Doesn't seem right. I feel like the more that I wait, you know, right, it just seems... Alright, I'll discard this. Alright, um, well... Yeah, we've also gone through half our deck now. Alright. Should I just concede? Is this what I'm doing now? Like, are we, are we, are we in the realm of like, oh, we're fighting until the bitter end, or this is a meme deck and we're just trying to get lucky? Uh, where are we at? Where are we at, people? I really don't know. What is this? Oh, okay. That's fine. Okay, it's fine. Let's do whenever a non-creature you control dies. Oh, this is just wrath protection. I guess I should just discard. Oh, I forgot this is a, a loot. This is a, a rummage. Well, there's a dragon's approach. Um, I'm going to actually discard this planes. Let's see if I can find some more stuff. Sure. Sure. 
I don't know what to do in this situation. I guess just keep finding dragon's approaches, right? Just keep, keep doing that. Keep getting the approaches and then whittle our opponent down. I guess I only need to find one more. Er, no, two more. Underworld dreams, you say? Okay, well... Here is more, um... Dragon's approaches. Like, you're at... You're at, uh... You're at two. Can I win the game by top decking a Dragon's approach? Is this draw a card? Okay. Oh, I guess that's... Okay. So you're gonna go up life points here. Oh, okay, they just Gary me. Alright, good game. It didn't matter anyways. <laughs> oh, that feels bad. Uh, blah, blah, blah. We got one win at least, so it's not a total loss. You know, I feel like, I feel vindicated that we got that one win, you know? It's just one. But it's there. It's there. Alright, this looks good. Let's do the thing that this deck was supposed to do, and that is cast Thrilling Discovery and loot away Dragon's Approach. Ooh, opponent got the Hateful Eidolon going. We don't care because we are not going to play any creatures for <laughs> the foreseeable future. We would typically play this to uh, put auras on our creatures and have them die, but that's not going to happen because we aren't playing anything until, like, turn four. Lampets, you say. Alright, let's play Cathartic Reunion, discarding Approach and Planes. That's a lot of merchants, you say. Um. Alright, let's just pass. We might actually discard a merchant here, because this is a lot of merchants. We don't need all of them. Um, we also might be casting Storm's Wrath next turn, depending on what our opponent does. Alright, yeah, let's haggle away a merchant. So... Hmm. I guess I want to wait, so I should just play the Merchant and loot away a Mountain, right? They're probably going to play something here that's going to kill this, but, um, like a Deadweight or something, but that's fine, right? The more important thing part is that we don't use our Storm's Wrath until um, the Lurus comes down. Interesting. So they're thinking here, but they didn't cast anything on their main phase. Which is kind of weird. I would expect them to, you know, do something. <laughs> they do cast alerts here, okay. Rated Scorpion, okay. Yeah, let's just cast a Haggle. Let's discard a Mountain. There's another Dragon's Approach. Um, we can... Storm's Wrath here. And then uh, see if we can find more Dragon's Approaches next turn. 
Oh, I feel like I just want to get rid of everything on the board here. Um, getting rid of Luris is pretty good. Actually, we can play Merchant, play this land, and loot away the Dragon's Approach. Ooh, they get back Luris with this. That's insane. Okay. Now, though, if we top deck a Dragon's Approach with this, we can get a lower hold on the battlefield. Wow. 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 Alright, well, we are guaranteed to get a lower hold next turn because we're either casting one or top decking a Dragon's Approach. Um... Wow. That was quite uh, quite the set of draws there. <laughs> Alright, so casting a Serrated Scorpion from their graveyard, casting the Order of Midnight from Exile, or from their Adventure Zone. What do you call it? Do you call it a name for it, or do you just like, whatever? Um... I feel like I just want a Dragon's Approach here. Get the card out of our deck. Um, I guess I'll just keep one of these, these lands to uh, discard. Ah, I see. Another black deck with removal. <laughs> Oh, we're so screwed. Why is everyone gotta play removal spells? Why they gotta do it? Why? Just let me have a fun. Let me have a fun. Uh, I mean, yeah. Hit me in the face. Alright. So he only has two cards left. If we hit Vorhol, if we play Vorhol and hit um, Storm's Wrath off of it, then we're in like a really good spot. Oh, well, there's a Storm's Wrath. Um, do we just do that? I kind of think we do. I don't want to play this land yet. I don't think I do. I think I'm just Storm's Wrathing here. And then doing nothing else. I'm going to wait on playing the land because if I want to discard it to Reunion, then I want to discard it to Reunion. Um, so, yeah, so our opponent here can sack two things uh, with the land pad. Lamp oh, I was saying lamp it. Lamp pad. Like a, a, a pad of, of lamps. <laughs> Take a bit of damage here, but no more Luris, and our opponent only has two cards in hand. I guess now three. Um, another Omen of the Dead. Yikes. They get to play another thing. Oh yeah. This is an interesting deck. This is like a good budget deck from them. I don't know if I necessarily call it budget. It's not like they're playing cards that they would normally be playing. I guess there's not many like cards that I would really put in that deck that uh, our opponent already doesn't have. Well, there's our <laughs> third Storm's Wrath. Yeah, let's just keep playing this. 
Uh, and just keep passing. So they can sack their omen to scry to improve their draw here. But unless it's something that gets back Luris or it gets them a lot of value, we're going to be able to play Lore Hold and do some stuff. Alright, they topped one thing, so that means that this card is probably pretty decent. Uh, I see. Is this more removal spells for our Lore Hold? Probably is. Ah, it is. <laughs> They gotta run out of removal spells at some point, right? Alright, well, there's some dragon's approaches. How many do we have in our graveyard now? We have one, two, three. One, two, three. So we got a top deck, two more. Alright, well, there's one. Now our next one will get us the uh, Lorold. Uh, I'm putting myself through this. All right, there we go. We, we <laughs> we're getting lucky yet unlucky. <gasps> All right. Um. So just catch another dragon's approach here. So if our opponent doesn't have a way to kill this, and next turn we top deck a Dragon's Approach and hit a Dragon's Approach, we have lethal. No, we don't. We, they have Light Flankers. What am I talking about? Um, okay, so Radiant Scorpion, that's fine. Oh, but they didn't attack. Hmm. I don't want to cast uh, Storm's Wrath here. Has it gone? Well, it's going all right. You know, I, 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 I can't complain. I don't know what I expected. They're up at three. They have to attack with their dudes. And there's a ton of cards that we can draw now. We've got them out of removal. They played a land. Okay. I think I don't block this, right? Gary would kill me anyways. Oh, they can't play Gary. Uh, so I don't have to worry about that. Um, What am I worried about here? Are we going to steal this game? Are we going to steal this game? Probably not. <laughs> this will be the second win of the day. We've played like five matches or something so far. Ugh. Oh. The thing is, there are the commands now. I got the commands working. So the two commands that are in the, the title, you can try those out. And they should work. Oh, am I dead? Oh, I'm dead. Wow. All right. <laughs> uh, that's about as well as I expected. Very nice opponent. Very nice. Wonderful. Alright, well, <laughs> on the search for a second win. Also trying not to D-rank. <laughs> oh, we might just ditch this and play something else, but uh, I'm having a good time. Can't complain. I mean, it's funny because like, it's like a meme deck and it's kind of like a turbo deck, but there are somewhat meaningful choices to be made. I, once again, can't keep this. This is worse, right? Is it... I guess there's so many... No, no, no. There's so many um, loot effects um, that I'm just going to keep these. Yeah. If I draw one loot effect like that, then this hand becomes great. Shadow Spear, you say. Alright, well, here is a Cathartic Reunion. 
We are reuniting with our dragons. Uh, our opponent here playing mono green, so unlikely to have um, removal. Yeah, they just play a love struck beast. I guess they'll play yeah that with um, just cast a dragon's approach here. I guess like we can haggle, discard a dragon's approach, and try and hit a um, that <laughs> hit a that. Uh, let's do this and discard a mountain. Do we even need planes for anything? I guess if we draw more thrilling discoveries. So our opponent here can equip the shadow spear and gain some life. Uh, oh, but they don't. Interesting. It's kind of odd. Why would they not uh, do that? Hmm. I mean, well, I'm gonna play a dragon's approach here and do some damage. Do some damage. 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 <laughs> All right. Slam it and wham it. Uh, I guess if we hit a Storm's Wrath, I will cast it because it stops the. Uh, well, we didn't, but if it did, it would have stopped the Storm, uh, the Love Strike Beast from attacking. I guess here we kind of do want to cast the Storm's Wrath next turn because yeah, we want to stop the, their ability to race us. Yeah. Hmm. They have a fight spell. <laughs> As I said, they didn't have removal. Um, are we dead? Yes. Uh, I guess not really. I guess I can technically cast Storm's Wrath and survive. Because this can't attack. If they play a 1-1, I will concede. <laughs> Okay, they have the adventure. All right, cool. <sighs> ah, yes, the D rank. <laughs> I just want one more. I want one more win with the deck. If we get one more win with the deck, I'll switch off of it and we'll, we'll uh, change the title of the stream. <laughs> <laughs> also probably play historic as opposed to standard um yeah this is fine right it's like not great but not bad oh boy not this again is this a deck is this an actual deck in the meta I'm actually surprised that this card is seeing play. Alright, let's do a Thrilling Discovery. Let's actually discard this and a Planes, because we want the double red. For Storm's Wrath if we draw it. Oh my god, we drew our <laughs> worlds! <laughs> um, it's just Dragon's Approach. No, oh, no, it's not the same deck. It's uh, Golgar, somewhere on a Golgari deck. Land, or sorry, uh, top deck, Storm's Wrath, please. Never lucky. <laughs> I guess I'll just play this. Oh, what am I doing? What am I doing with my life, guys? All right, now I really need the. Um, Actually, that wouldn't even get me. That wouldn't clear me the board. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna block that. Why would I not? It's kind of weird that they would do that. 
All right, I will um, play that. So that's on top. We can end a turn of loot. Are we dead? I don't think we're dead. They cast two spells here. We can't block this. Then we have to block this. So you have to block here. We'll loot away this. If we top deck our last four hold, I swear to God. Okay, that's our opponent got. It's a weird uh, thing to play. Oh wait, was that not the? Oh well, all right, cool. Oops, <laughs> I thought that was the uh, the fourth one. Or the fifth one, whatever it was. I thought it was the last one we needed. Come on. <laughs> There's so much has to go right for this to work. We have to have a, a, a good hand. Uh, we have to not draw our lure holds. Uh, and we have to have our opponent not have removal. <laughs> and not die, I'm sorry. And also not die. I'm gonna mulligan this because we don't have white again. If we had, if one of these was a planes, this is my thing. Is like, why doesn't this deck have? I guess I should just be running the pathway, the needle verge pathway. I don't, I didn't have that in the deck originally because that's like it's supposed to be budget, right? But like, I probably should just have it. I'm gonna put the storm's wrath back. We'll haggle away this dragon's approach. Is that right? Maybe I should keep the storm's wrath. Oh, well, we drew, uh, drew one anyways. Oh, we drew many of them. Um, let's Cathartic Reunion, discarding a land and Storm's Wrath. And we're playing Rogues again. I don't think we can win against Rogues. Can we win against Rogues? Can we ever win against Rogues? Ooh, there were some good mills. Wait, do we have... We do. We have it, guys. Thanks, opponent. We got it. We got it. We did it. <laughs> There's five. There's actually five. Storm's Wrath? Storm's Wrath. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go! <laughs> <laughs> Boom! So now our opponent has to spend their turn um, answering the lore hold. Or not. Just put another dragon's approach in our bin. Like they're just helping us. They they wanted us. They're they're uh, secretly watching. They want us. They want to help us. Uh, there's one, two. There's only two. Let's just attack the lower hold first. Because if we hit a dragon's approach, we can just cast our dragon's approach. Okay, there's a dragon's approach. <laughs> yeah, the strifty is right. Hey, look, they're helping us. Bam. <laughs> They not have... Okay, I was about to be like, how can they have a... Uh... Oh, they're really helping us. <laughs> I would like to take this action. <laughs> we did it! <laughs> We're back to where we started. All right, what do we think? We'll do one more. See if we can get one more win, and then uh, say no to this deck. I mean, the fact that it won a game. Yeah, they were dead. Uh, the fact that we won a game there against rogues, probably the top 
to your deck in the format. Um, I don't think I can do a poll on this yet. Let me see Hitch Extreme Labs. Let's see if they have a poll system. How about... Oh, there is a poll. Yeah. Let me see. I might do that and see if people want to... Um, want me to switch off decks? Or keep keep trying to make this work. This is a mulligan. I've got a lot of hands like this of just like several dragons brooches and nothing else. I guess... Yeah, this is a no, right? Alright, this is way better. Milamachus combo is direct counter, or uh, direct counter or combo to rogues? Yeah. I, I mean, they have removal. If they had any removal. Okay, our opponent's got an interesting deck here with Adventurous Impulse. Getting a pathway. Oh, I'm going to try and set up the pole. Let me see. Oh wait, never mind. Um, oh, do they get nothing out of my hand? That's funny. This is how this works. Done. All added. Uh, I don't know who these people are. Uh, that's kind of weird. Can't even see it. Um, I don't know. It's probably fine. It's just moderator, my auto moderation system doing its thing. I don't know. Um, but I do have the poll. So after this game, I will start that poll and and uh, see how that works. Because I have no idea. We'll see how that goes. Questing beast. Top deck storms right here. Anyone? Hmm. So close. Um. Let's just do this. So we're probably not dead next turn, but uh, I'm nervous because we're going to six, and hmm. Great Henge, okay. And an Adventurous Impulse. For a Love Strike Beast. So we're gonna be able to Vorhold here. Or Lorehold. Oh my god, I keep on saying Vorhold. Uh, if we can hit Storm's Wrath, that would be ideal, right? And we're pretty likely to, right? Because we're. We don't have any. Um, We can actually do this and thin our deck out even more. 
because we can yeah, we can do this discard these oh, well there's a storm's a storm's rat that's kind of bad isn't that bad because now we uh Storm's Wrath? Storm's Wrath, one time. Let's go. Boom. And we have lethal next turn, right? Or, no, 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 close to lethal, because, uh... Yeah, our opponent is gonna gain some life with Love Strike Beat. Oh, no, that only draws them... Uh, sorry, they gain life with Great Edge by tapping it. So that's fine. Mm hmm. <laughs> oh. Lol. Alright, let's see. Let's do a, a quick test of the poll and see if the poll works. Poll started. What does it say in my chat? Yes, so there's, there's... Oh, you love it? Okay, that's good. Yeah, so there's a vote going. Uh, it was actually more of like a test to see how the poll system works. So it looks like there's vote uh, type exclamation point vote. Uh, or sorry, exclamation point vote followed by either exclamation point switch or exclamation point no switch. And... Test that out and let me see what I what I see because let me see if that works. Uh, while that's going though, I'm gonna do another game. It's actually winning somehow, and by that, like we're getting very lucky. We're getting. Lucky and unlucky with our matchups. Yeah, like, we got... Uh, rogues should be a bad matchup, actually, because they have plenty of counter spells and removal, but, like, rogues ended up milling us and not having removal, so then we just clobbered them by casting... Uh, we got to Dragon's Approach on turn three because, uh... Let me see if that works. Do I see that? Uh, do, do, uh, do exclamation point vote. Yeah, there, there, exclamation point vote. Yeah, there, there you go. You got it. Um, I'm actually gonna mulligan this. Yeah, I'm gonna mulligan this. Okay, this is good, right? Uh, just put back, uh, land. And then we can cathartic reunion on two, yeah. Like what, uh, do it, do it Murph did, uh, uh, Shrifty. But whatever you feel, like, again, if you don't care, like, then you don't care, but, uh... Just not, yeah, I see the vote. Okay. Cool, that's cool. Alright, so we have a voting system now if I want to do stuff like that. Swank. Um... Oh, our opponent has counter magic up, so I'm gonna... Thrilling Discovery first. Okay. Uh, I guess I am doing this to discard this plus a land. We shall see. We shall see. Oh, wait. Wait, what deck is this? What what deck plays Prismaric? Oh, is it the um Galazeth? The Galazeth deck probably plays I don't I don't know anything about the standard metagame is my problem right now is I don't know any of the decks because I don't play standard. Oh, there's Goldspan Dragon, okay. 
Wait, that allows us to get going, right? Yeah, wait. Uh, I'm gonna do this first. But unless they have negate, right? Unless they have negate, then we're good. Bellamachus, scene play in modern, I feel like is very unlikely. Um, there's not a lot of, I guess like, I mean like, think about it, like Path to Exile is in the format, like Bellamachus is just really bad against removal. Um, so what can we hit here? Yeah, this is like the uh, treasure uh, deck. So there's Storm's Wrath here. Storm's Wrath seems good. But do we want to cast um, a Dragon's Approach instead? I think I'm going to go with the Storm's Wrath here. I don't know. The control player in me is really wanting to just answer our opponent's threats. But maybe we really should just be more aggressive. Um, I guess, no, I want to put put pressure on them because the red removal spells have a, are going to have a hard time dealing with the five power, right? So, um, I probably just want to attack. Yeah, okay, there we go. Oh, they brazen bar me. Actually, that's better than, um, so I'm going to cathartic reunion and actually discarding both of these. Oh, do they have counter magic? Oh, they don't. Okay. Um, like, I, I, maybe if there was, like, you know, some kind of... Oh, they just had Mystical Dispute. Okay. Um, if there was some kind of, you know, like, taking turns deck that was able to do the math or whatever and make it work, maybe, but paying seven... Like, you would have to have a way to turbo it out, right? So you'd have to have, um, you know, something that can get it out cheap, cheap um, which we don't really have in Modern, and then also you would need something that um, makes it go infinite with like extra turn spells. So you'd have to have a ramp deck that is like, think about it, like is both. Um... So we have three, if there's a dragon's approach on top of our deck, then we get a, never, never, never uh, punished. Uh, this is pretty close, right? So we play this, we attack with it. We get a dragon's approach and they go to one. And they have to answer this turn, or, uh... Face the consequences! Mwahahaha! <laughs> um... Do I block? No, right? I make him do it. Make him do something. Yeah, I guess let's... They have, uh... Ooh! 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 There's a dragon's approach. Do you have a counterspell? Okay, they do have a counterspell. Do you have... I'm just, oh, you have the Brazen Borrower to block. Sure. So I should just play this, right, and pass. Behold, let me see. All right, hold up. Let me look at this. Uh, so we got Crow Spiral and Downable Creativity. So there's there's the way to turbo it out. Uh, where's Mari Command? Sure, that's fine. So like, yeah, they're, okay, sorry, let me look at this. Dwarven mine, interesting. And then how do you, oh, you have Savior of the Moment and Time Warp to loop. Okay, like, yeah, like, that's fine. It just doesn't seem like, it just doesn't seem like something that's going to win uh, lots of tournaments ever, you know, any, anytime soon. 
Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and block here and then uh, loot, probably. With... Honestly, probably just gonna get rid of the Storm's Wrath. If we draw a land... Then we can cast the Velimachus. They might have a counterspell here, but if they do, we're not dead, necessarily. So... Okay, so they mystical dispute us. So we could go to two here. If they top deck Bone Crusher Giant, we're dead, right? Yeah, let's cast that. work oh my goodness Is that two wins in a row yeah i mean i think it's interesting again that's but like that's kind of just how modern is where you know janky dex or whatever right you know like what was it um bring to light right bring to light was a card that like never really saw any good playing standard i believe because that was also during the time where like aggro decks were like really big all right bring to light was never a really good card in standard but like bring to light in modern was like like does a lot of stuff you know so you know that, that's just kind of how modern is because of the the range of the format um you can just do so much stuff and that's good um right but like something like lore Holden's being like yeah this is a, a a deck that's gonna do things um probably not like the, I'm, I'm impressed by the fact that it 5 would because that, that's what it said right if 5 would uh yeah, if I'm, I'm impressed that at 5-0 the league, like, that's something that I would not expect a deck like that to be able to do. Um, okay. So, I'm confused by our opponent being a Lurus deck, but also having red mana. Oh, it's cycling. <laughs> that answers my question. All right, so there's our last dragon's approach. So I can... Thrilling Discovery, discarding this and a dragon's approach. And there you go. If our opponent doesn't have counter magic here or something, we'll be in the biz. She got opponent. Leaving up mana. I don't like when my opponent does that. What what cards could they be playing here? I'm like confused what they could be playing. It's like they can't play Brazen Barber. I can't. It's probably something with cycling. Alright, just cast another Dragon's Brooch. Alright, now our opponent's at 9. So yeah, they're gonna probably cycle two cards here, yeah. Deal us some damage. Jeskai cycling. So what is... What is having uh, blue get you? Like, you're not casting, like, boon, right? I'm just not going to block. I, I don't care. Uh... Okay, Flourishing Fox. Um, I'm going to play the land and then just attack, because if they do anything... Um before all right then i can just uh am i killing my opponent on turn four Well, it took us a little bit to find the right matchups, right? But, like, we're getting there. 
Kinda, right? <laughs> Oh my goodness. Ugh. Well, let me type the... Let me make sure that this works, right? That should work. Yeah, there we go. We have a question of the day that we'll do every stream. And today's is, what deck are you playing? Or what is your favorite deck to play? Or also, just what deck are you current? Currently playing on Arena. Boy. This is a mulligan, right? Oh no. Alright. This is actually fine over here. Actually, this is interesting is that this deck is actually fine at mulliganing because uh, as long as we have lands, a uh, discard effect, and two dragons approaches, like, we're good. Okay, well, drawing three lands is not good. <laughs> Luminaric Asper. There's a Boros aggro deck? Really interesting. Yeah, the, the blue to, to cast. Yeah, but like that really didn't do anything for them there, right? That added, like, like I guess it didn't really hurt them because their deck is, is mostly blue uh, or red-white anyways, so like... And then their cycling abilities are colorless, so like the deck can splash. It's just like it's just not really worth it because they didn't. You don't want to be casting. If you have six lands and you're not killing your opponent with, you know, your um whatever it is the, the lightning helix card. Like you're probably not winning the game. Exile and online permit, but this is a sorcery, so that's fine. Um. I was about to be like, I want to cast Storm's Wrath, but now they have that. I'm just going to Dragon's Approach here. If we tap deck a Dragon's Approach... I gotta sneeze. <laughs> Whew. Um. Um. Yeah, if we tap deck a Dragon's Approach, we can get our Vorhold. Um... I'm gonna place another selfless savior. Oh boy. Ooh. Well, we tactic a dragon's approach. If this hits a dragon's or oh sorry, if this hits uh, if Lordhold hits a storm's wrath, then uh, we might be in a good spot. Alternatively, um. We might be in a good spot anyways if we hit Dragon's Approach, because our opponent's going to go to six, right? Or no, three. Yeah, I'm just going to take the Dragon's Approach and cast it. it. means our opponent has to attack with the All Seed here. I'm just going to pass. I'm not playing the Mountain. Um, dang. Oh, also, I forgot our opponent has this, so they're going to exile it, so, um, yeah, unfortunate. Um, dang, that's a very impressive uh, thing for the professor. The learn mechanic is uh, getting something like that. But they otherwise probably wouldn't want to have removal in their deck. Attacking creatures have double strike. Uh, if I block here, I guess this saves me two damage and forces them to uh, use the selfless savior. This is 12. Oh, wait a sec. Am I just dead? of those this is 12 damage 14 if I block here if I block here it's 6 10 14 
Dang, I'm just dead. Okay. Does that save me? No, it probably doesn't save me, right? Yeah. Alright, well. That was insane. Opponent had uh, the things to disrupt us enough. Like here, it's Oops. Six, my channel. Ten. There we go. I was trying to get to my dashboard. Uh, I'll keep this. There we go. All right. Let's not draw three lands when we cast our Cathartic Reunion this time. <clears throat> I said let's <laughs> What is that? What is that? <sighs> oh. That was the worst three draws followed by a fourth not so great one, because we really don't want lower hold in our hand. Oh. Oh. Again, apologies for the for the lighting that's gonna flicker in and out. Uh, all right, we'll cast our thrilling discovery. Uh, let's play the mountain. I don't know. How many dragon spreads have we got in there? All right, we need one more from our deck. Haggle will hopefully get us there. That's a bone crusher. Oh, did they suspend something? I mean, foretell, whatever it's called. Uh, I don't need to respond to this at all because I don't know what this is, but it's not really relevant. It's just a mountain, okay. All right, hopefully we tap deck a dragon's approach. Perfect. Bam. Bam. I'm gonna get the storm strike here. Uh, it gets rid of a threat as well as a card advantage engine for our opponent. Um. And we're one dr land draw away from casting. Um, is there probably a Brazen Bar here? Yeah, I was going to assume that was coming. What do I want to do here? So I just want to... Uh, Thardic Reunion, discarding a land and a Storm's Wrath. Am I giving up on casting Storm's Wrath here? Probably, right? Oh my goodness. Thrilling Discovery I'm gonna keep, because that can draw me some extra lands. Ay ay ay. So they draw a gold span dragon. Which, actually, that's fine, right? Because we lore hold here? They have a negate? No, okay, no. Oh, but they can have Brazen Borrower again. That's annoying. Alright, well, I can pressure them with attacking with the Merchant. So they go to 7...
Oh no. That's really bad. So they're attacking me for let's see, six, this is eight damage. They have two bone crushers and dead. the best chance I win this game. I need to end the game this turn. Um, if I cast this and the dragons, or sorry, and hit dragons approach and they have nothing I win, they have brazen borrower. Do I just lose regardless? So I just shouldn't even play around it. But they have a way to counter my spells. I think I just don't have any way of uh, getting through, right? So I'm just going to jam Vorhold. I know it might seem like I'm playing dumb, but um, this is the best chance of winning the game. And uh, if they have Brazen's Borrower, which it looks like it, they do, I was never winning this game. <sighs> so... Now that they have let me go i'm actually going to storm's wrath here because should i storm's wrath or should i just go for it you know what? we didn't come here to be chicken we didn't come here to be chicken we are we have we are bold we are bold today oh i guess i didn't think about them just casting um It was on board. You know what? I'm dumb. Yep, yeah, that was a misplay. I'm done. I'm gonna concede here, because I'm bad. That game was winnable. Uh, I'm just bad. <laughs> oh, apologies. We could've won that game. We could've won that game so easily. Oh well. Alright, the poll is still up. If people want to vote, I'll put it up again. Can I put it up again? Uh, how do I repost the poll? Don't think I can repost the poll, but, um, it is whether I should switch decks, and to do so, you vote, uh, exclamation point vote, followed by either exclamation point, uh, switch, or exclamation point no switch. I should put it up on, like, the screen or something, but... Uh, in a game. Uh, this hand looks great. Um, and also, if you guys have ideas for decks that you want me to play, I'm down to, to see, you know, I have an extensive collection, so... Uh, I can probably build, you know, whatever, uh, you want me to play. Uh, or I can just craft the cards, whatever. Uh... Yeah, that that was that was a total misplay on my part. Uh, we totally could have won that last game. Floral Hedron, you say? All right, I'm gonna loot here, right? Yeah, it's Looteroni. Get me a Zamboni. So we need another Dragon's Approach, so we can cast Thrilling Discovery next turn. Um. Yep, 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 yep. What is our opponent doing? Um, all right, so I'm gonna play the planes here just in case I draw another thrilling discovery. We're gonna cast this here. Okay. And I'm actually only going to discard one approach because I want the other one to cast next turn, obviously. Let's discard that. Ooh. I didn't really need to. Alright, 
let's see what kind of a deck our opponent is playing. Uh, it's probably just a Yorian value deck. Oh, hello. Thank you for tapping out. Thank you for tapping out, opponent. Oh, I guess they didn't really tap out. They probably have removal now. And I'm gonna be sad. No removal. Um, I'm just gonna cast Thrilling Discovery here, right? Thrilling? Oh uh, no, I'm just gonna catch another Dragon's Approach. Bam. Oh, it's just the Omen of the Sea. Okay. Anyone else just like their their heart just like does a like a double take or like does like a jump like whenever there's like that weight between whether we get to attack with lore hold or not. It's thrilling. <laughs> Solve the equation, you say, for a removal spell, I assume. That's a removal spell. Are they gonna do it? They're gonna do it here though! No opponent! No! Don't do that. I guess they are not guaranteed to get a approach next turn, so it's probably fine for them, but... Alright. So we're gonna haggle, discard this approach. There's another approach. There's another one! We did it! We did it! We won the game! <laughs> Oh my goodness. We won the game. The game has been won by us. What did we get? Avalanche call. Cool. I'm always so underwhelmed. I'm always so excited by rewards, yet underwhelmed when I see that they are boring. Ah. Uh. Alright, Sam looks fantastic. That is as good as it gets, right? I guess, you know, don't want to be picky, but, you know, the lower hold is there, but don't really care about that. That's what I was also thinking. I was, like, wondering why they don't run. There's only three lower holds in the deck, and it's because, you know, the um, you don't want to draw them as much. Because not only are they bad, but you want them in the deck. Um, all right, psh, more approaches. Uh, we just need one more looting effect. We should have turn four approach probably this is the same deck this is the same deck or a very similar deck okay there's another looting effect nice Let's see what our opponent does here so this could be a negate which is really unfortunate or uh sorry uh, uh saw that coming but i guess we don't care about drawing the three cards now. Oh, that that was not a see you com uh, saw it coming. There was no delay. So what is that card then? Is that just Alren's Alren's Epiphany? I'm gonna cast this. Please don't cast Test of Talents. This might be a, the type of deck that would run Test of Talents. All right, they got removal, but we're gonna we're gonna run into it. Wait, what? Uh, I want to actually cast Cathartic Reunion, don't I? Put these dragons approaches in the bin and draw some more. Bam. So this way, if they remove um. If they remove our lower hold, we're that much closer to um, getting another one. 
That's fine. Yeah, we can... Thrilling Discovery, and then if we draw another uh, Dragon's Approach... Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Let's do it. We are doing it, guys. This... So, like, I feel like the, the good draws of this deck are kind of needed. Like, you do need to draw well with this deck, because if you don't, then you're not having a good time. Um, but if you're drawing well, you feel like your deck's powerful, even though your opponent might end up winning the game. So, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so there's the Allruns Epiphany that we saw coming. They have Death Touch. You gotta remember that. Yeah, so this definitely seems like the deck that uh, our opponent played uh, last round, or last game. Okay. Alright, wait. There has to be some kind of thing for, like, if we make it to gold with this. What happens if we make it to gold? What happens if we make it to gold with this deck, guys? Hold on, let me open this pack real quick. What should we do? How should I reward myself? <laughs> We'll see. We're so close. I guess I can reward myself by switching off of the deck. <laughs> uh, that would be a reward for me. Dad's great. I do like that there is a lot of consistency and redundancy in the draw, uh, the discard draw twos. Oops. Like that does make me um, feel good. I'm gonna go ahead and just haggle here. If we um, draw into another approach, that'll be good. Okay, no approach, but that's fine. Um, I'm gonna discard an approach and a planes. I love the moment everybody just starts reading the the, the approaches. Alright, so there are three approaches. Wow, this is like the opposite of last game where instead of drawing three lands, we draw all three approaches that we want. <laughs> That's kind of cheap. That felt kind of cheap, right? That was anticlimactic. We're gonna do more. We're, we're gonna... We're gonna... We're gonna do more. Potato. We're facing a potato. And we have a, another fantastic hand here. Loving it. Loving it. Could have used a discard spell, but... Oh well. Can't complain. Esper, you say? So 
So we're on track to get lure hold on turn five, which is not exciting, but I even want to play these. I guess at most I'm discarding a land. Lucranos, you say. Alright, so we're probably going to hit on an approach off of this. Yep. So unless our opponent has a way of gaining life, uh, we have lethal. Even if they do. Um, sorry, they also have to spend three of their mana. Uh, to fight uh, with our their Pelucranos. So, uh, and we just drew our last four holds, so thank goodness. This feels cheap. This feels like cheating. This very much feels like cheating. <laughs> Do one more, and if we get a loss, then we'll switch off. One more loss, and we'll switch off. If I keep winning, I'm gonna keep playing the deck, but uh. I don't see a reason to mulligan this. Facing another Yorian deck. And so far, those seem to be good matchups for this deck. We could really use a discard spell. It's another Sultai or Simic uh, Yorian deck. Looks like it. Uh, I'm gonna actually play Merchant. Merchant might be able to loot here. Uh, draw us into discard spells. Uh, or they're just gonna kill it. In which case, that kind of gets removal out of their hands, so it's probably fine. <laughs> now they just get a Yorian. Or they have to discard, though. It's a weird play for them to make. Um, yeah, I'm actually gonna loot and discard an approach. I guess I should just be casting them, but I really do want to dig through our deck and, and, and find some ways to accelerate it. Alright, there's the Cultivator. I find it interesting that they're playing this card. Alright, there's Thrilling Discovery, that's perfect. We draw into a mountain, we get to... Oh my goodness. I guess I'll play it, but boy am I sad. My goodness. Again, apologies for the late. There's nothing I can do about it. All right, let me close that poll because now we're done with that. Uh, that's Vorinclex? Sure. Why not? I think I just need to cast the, this and uh, go for it. Bam. Bam. So I'm gonna cast more dragons approaches. I guess I'll play this, because if they deal with my board, and I can uh if they deal with my Villamachus, I can cast. Oh. Yeah, I forget that they're just ultimatum decks, and I have to concede to this card.
Uh, what does Valky do? I think I actually just get rid of this, right? Because because Valky only exiles this. Because also if he oh wait, what does this do? Yeah, Vorinclex makes this difficult. If they don't, they lose three life. Um, let's discard this. Let's discard this. And then decline. Decline? Oh, shoot. Um, I guess let's just do this. Shoot. Um, I guess just decline again. Oh, it's six times. Jeez. I have to discard this. Um, am I dead? Probably, right? Yeah. Dang. I didn't know it was six times. I thought it was five. <sighs> but, like, also think about, like, any deck would lose to that. 